Hey, hey, it's Berta J. I'm in my kitchen peeling clementines today. We're gonna make a really simple, easy, but quite yummy, a frozen dessert made from frozen clementines. I froze them. What you do is you take five of these little clementines. They have different brands in the store. You choose your favorite. And I am gonna show you what I did. You can use mandarins. You want something that's small, but you could use mandarins, clementines, also use uh, tangerines if they're smaller. Tangerines can uh, get a little bigger. Pull it apart. You see all this pithy stuff on the inside? You gotta get this out. Take out all that stuff, all that pith and, and all that stuff right there. Get rid of that. So after you've done that for five of these, you're going to put them on a baking sheet. This is my baking sheet from my toaster oven. You can find a smaller one, put it in your freezer. I did it for overnight, but you can do it as long as you go in and they're hard. I think that'd probably be about three, four hours. Once you've done that, go to your food processor and you're gonna put in all these sections, a tablespoon of maple syrup. Get it all and then a teaspoon of vanilla. And the last is use your favorite plant creamer and, and use a third of a cup. Put the top on, let it spin. I want you to know that it's gonna be kind of crumbly looking. Just be patient, just keep spinning. You will spin for about a minute and a half. It's not super hard. If you want it super hard, don't put it in as much of your creamer and it'll be harder than this. This is a little soft and as I said, use less of your favorite creamer and it'll be harder. Maybe a fourth of a cup or two or three tablespoons. And I'm gonna use this little dessert spoon and I'm gonna taste it. This is good. You taste the vanilla. You don't like that push back on the vanilla. Maybe you use three quarters of a teaspoon, half a teaspoon. But I like that vanilla taste. It kind of reminds you of a dreamsicle. I don't even know if they make those anymore. But it has that orange flavor with a little vanilla in it. It's really good. But that really is the end of the video. That's it. That's all. I think I'm going to try, I know I'm going to try other fruits. I would say you could do strawberry, raspberry, freeze them first. Strawberry, raspberry is what comes to mind. You could do peach. Blueberry if you like blueberries. I'm not a blueberry fan, but I will eat them. Try some frozen fruit, throw it in there with the same measurements and see what happens, okay? Maybe we'll be having a, a frozen dessert by whatever that fruit is all summer long. That's the end. So I'll say, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to click on the bell so that every time a new video is uploaded, you will get the notification and leave me some comments below. Let me know what you think of this recipe and if you try it. And if you do, let me know that too. Okay, bye for now.